hello and welcome and welcome back to the african print diy channel by the way these are my social media pages so please do follow me so i was inspired to make a drawstring bag and uh, these are the materials that i used i'm going to describe them in the description box and then so first i measured my fabric i measured two pieces of fabric that were 18 and 16 inches long 18 inches wide and 16 inches long and there were two of these and I just measured with my ruler and marked with my choke and then I cut using pinking shears So here are my two pieces like I said before I had two pieces and then I measured about two inches from the longest um, edge and then I folded in about five millimeters and then I ironed and then I folded it back again to the line to that line that you see there and then I ironed it this was just to make it easier for me when I go to sew it on the sewing machine and then I just put some pins And then after that, I just sewed it on the sewing machine. And I did this for both pieces. So here are my two pieces when they were done. And then I laid them against each other, like the right sides facing each other. And then I started inserting the rope. So this rope all in all was four meters. And the width of this rope is like very thin, probably to be maybe five millimeters or less than five millimeters and then so basically you have to put it in like through that um gap that i sewed and then so it is to go in the first one and out then go into the other one as well and out until you have like two ropes sticking out on both And I did this using a safety pin, like I always do. And I just pulled all the cords together, the ropes, to just make sure that everything was aligning. And that the ropes were equal. You don't want to have like a lopsided bag. And then I put it inside like that, as you can see. And then I leave the rope and I take it like outside like that so that when I sew, when I change inside out, it will go, it will be on the inside. And you may want to just tie it so that it doesn't like go through. So I'm going to sew over this rope and you may want to maybe go back and uh, sew maybe two or three times because these are stress points. And then after that, I just pinned the bag all around. So as you can see the ropes are inside like that and then I just sewed that on the sewing machine and then I turned it inside out and you have a drawstring bag so thank you so much for watching this video guys i appreciate you being here today please do respond with a like comment if you're not yet subscribed